Okay, so this is my new Tyker uh, tripod. Some things that I really like about it that I'm going to go through with you. Obviously, you get the carry case with it. And there's the tripod. Uh, aluminium, so nice and sturdy. You've got the lock on there. Uh, I'll, I'll go through each of the things with you. We'll just do the size first. So, nice, easy, fast clips. Undo them, leg out. So fully adjustable basically to, to any height. Um, when we've done this, I'll just measure the height for you so that you can see it. Also, the feet are adjustable, as you can see there. So you should be able to get it nice and stable on pretty much any surface. Solid clips. Right. So, there we go. And the height of that is, in inches and centimetres, it's four foot in inches, so uh, 48 inches, and uh, 122 centimetres. Now, I'll just leave it up for a moment, and we'll have a look at the head. So, what we've got here is, an easily removable plate, you can see there. And obviously underneath is your, your turning screw. Now, it's got a bit of rubber on top, so you should have a sound bed, but it is plastic. So depending on, um, on what for photography tackle you're using, if you're using a wide arm, for example, it, it may, um, it may bend and not be as stable as you want it to be, but it easily goes back in like that. If you've got something on it, you can unscrew that and go from a horizontal to a vertical. And you've also got your bubble level there. Just close that. Now, some things that come with it, Right, a couple of things that come with it. You've got a, a mobile phone holder there, which I'll attach and show you. But what's really good is you've got this um, Android and Apple remote control. Now, I've already obviously set it up with my phone and it was really easy. It's simply a case of turn your Bluetooth on on your phone, go to the settings, and you've got the, uh, the name of this in the settings just pair it and then straight away you can start taking pictures but I'll show you that in a moment first of all I'm just going to attach this to the plate of the tripod all right so I've taken the plate off and I'm going to put the mobile phone holder onto it uh, it's literally a case of pop it on there Oops, it pop it on there like that and then screw it down into place nice and easy to do and then if we come back up, you'll see, easy to go in. Just clicked it into place like that. Uh, I'll get my phone and I'll show you. Show you. So here's my Samsung S8 Plus and it literally pops into place. Pops into place like so. And if you come round, you'll be able to see it. And we go back, I'll open it up, and there we go, there's the camera. Now, if you remember what I was saying about that, so as you can see this now, there's the Android button, it's on the screen, it's highlighted with a blue square, which it isn't normally, and if you press the button, it takes the picture. If I keep my finger on it, it takes a number of pictures. But really useful for for remote uh, remote photo taking, especially for a selfie or something like that. Um, and again, what I was showing you, if you undo that, you can just flip it to the vertical, lock it off, no problem. If we have a look underneath here, we've got the hook where you can hang a weight on it to make it even more stable, depending where you are. Uh, and I think that that is is basically it. This is. Uh, it's a well-priced, does-it-all tripod. Stable, 
Um, the feet are good on it, the connectors are good on it, and uh, it's a definite recommendation from me. In addition to that, what I haven't shown you is also, if you, if you unlock the center pole there, you can, you've got slight adjustment in the height of it as well. So what I'll do is I'll just give you the, the full height of it with that extended. I'll just get the tape measure again and we can see it. Takes up quite a bit that. And now we've got a height of, um, about 58 inches or 148 centimeters. So all in all, very nice.